And we are back yet again. This time, I couldn't, in all, you know, uh, play Melina without playing Katana. So, because I might have talked some shit about Katana in the other videos, but I'm going to show you with the proper mastery you can own with Katana. As before in my other video, I read the bio card, so here is Katana's. Just a steel town girl on a Saturday night looking for the fight of her life. Wait, that is. Oh! Fucking wrong thing. Her beauty hides her true role as personal assassin for Shao Kahn. Seen talking to an Earthrealm warrior, her motives have come under suspicion by her twin sister, Melina. But only Kitana knows her own true intentions. Could there be dissension in the art world? I know in the first one I said out world, but when I heard it, it said art world. That might be a new thing for me now. Dissension in the art world. God, Katana, take a fucking beating like a champ. Jesus, what are you, a wife from the 50s? Oh. Come on now. There's that fan. The legendary fan. Curious to know what you guys are thoughts on, like, the video game fans compared to the movie fan. That was like it was a fucking sword that it turned into a fan. Um, but she didn't even bring it out to what? Annihilation? I'm gonna annihilate that motherfucker right there. Come here! Mm. I've always felt, even though I said fun fact, like, Melina's slightly faster than Katana. I, I kind of believe it. Like, I feel though she might be slightly slower. Like she's heavier to control or something. Maybe Melina's in better shape. Who knows? But as I said in the other video, um ho 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 Um Why do I keep mumbling? Um, um, um. They said in the other video, Katana was played by the same actress, good old palette swapping shit. And that actress happens to look like my friend's mom and now I kinda had this weird fantasy where I want to dress up my friend's mom in MK2 female ninja costumes. Wouldn't that be fun? Anyway, um, if you're ever watching this, Caitlin, Zamira, Zamiar, or whatever, like, no, I'm not a creep or anything like that. Just an admirer. Nothing could be more dangerous, as Gandhi would say. Oh, just mosh, dude, had been is that a dinosaur in the background? It's always piqued my curiosity as well. Like, I'm curious to know the wildlife, the uh, the zoology of of Outworld, Outworld zoology. That'd be an interesting topic. Huh? Should be done. Somebody should make a video on that. And there's the wasteland, my second favorite level of the. Mortal Kombat 2 levels. First has to be the tower with the Shadow Priest in the clouds. Oh, but I love the portal too. Oh, great. Oh, great. I'm just yawning today. I do not know what's going on. So, I've already read her bio and all that fun stuff. But, like, of course she'd be Baraka. I'm, I can't pull off Katana's fatalities, like, they ain't easy. Don't you know what Gil Gilbert, o what's that old Gilbert O'Sullivan song go? It's not easy to pull off a Katana fatality in Mortal Kombat 2? Something like that. Maybe that was Jim Croce. I'm not sure. Boom. That, that's my, this is my favorite level. Like, so beautiful. And it was so gorgeously redone in Shaolin Monk's video game that I never tend to shut the hell up about. And it's like, I haven't played it in like seven years, but like I go back and play again. It's like, oh, this was it. Imagine. Also, I'm so sorry. These yawns here are just, God, I hate that fucking projectile. Like, earlier that Jax just threw. Not a fan of Jax either. I'm just not a fan of Jax. I don't like his moveset. I do like when he says, gotcha! I like the character Jax, but I'm just... I've never been a big Jax guy! That's right. Me trying to pull off a big album. 
babality. A babality. A babalality. Oh, I'd fucking win every single goddamn time with those. Count Kriukov wins. Babalality. Oh, the big sunglasses guy. Oh god, the living forest. It's so weird because like I was just doing a playthrough with Shang Tsung and it's it's totally not gonna make it up. But um it started off with the living forest instead of the Deadpool and I was like Huh. I wonder if that has anything to do with just like waiting at the title screen and letting the uh, story unfold. Because there is a sort of a story if you wait. Uh, the title screen. Oh fuck yeah, dude! I was just murdering Johnny Cage again. Like Johnny Cage has shown no quarter in this playthrough or any of my playthroughs. Just like oh, you never even had a chance. Like her outworld skills or assassin skills are too much. Like did you see how fast she crouched and then kicked him in the shin? You killed him. Katana killed the guy. Oh, the mirror fight. That's right, I'm fighting Elizabeth Hurley from Austin Powers 1. Oh, come on, if I didn't make that reference, about 78 other people would have. But yeah. That's right, Katana, because if you're not being controlled by me or your regular AI, then you suck. Bring it on, Elizabeth Hurley. Let's get Randy. Speaking of Randy, did you know that there's a band named Randy? Like this uh, new wave British British new wave of British heavy metal band in the 80s called Randy. Not 100% if they were British heavy metal, but there was a band called Randy, and they have a song called The Beast. That's all I know about Randy or Randy Savage, Macho Man. All right, let's get on to this Liu Kang character. I know your tricks. You're so fucking predictable, Liu Kang. Backflip. Ha! Nice try. Falling for bicycle kick shit. Dead challenge. The Denny and Princess Kitana. Princess Kitana from Dead Oh my god, how many times do you think I can spam that in this video? Kitana wins because she's over 10,000 years old. Never a fan of the Liu Kang Kitana thing. I mean, she could do way better. Just saying. Don't like the Katana's look in Mortal Kombat 11? Like, what's the dealio with that? Like, it's like, is there, are they just trying to do a thing? Or it's like... Boom. Gown. Um, are they just trying to do a thing where just Melina gets progressively hotter and Katana gets progressively uglier? Just like... Not even that she's not that ugly in the... The new game, she's just like, okay. How dare she look realistic. I like my f fighting female characters to be overtly sexualized. <laughs> like, see, the cool thing is, like, they're super hot in this game, but, like, it's pretty conservative. So, you know, do what thou will. I don't see anything wrong with costumes. At all. I mean, maybe for Reptile, I mean, he's pretty... He's pretty over-sexualized in this game. Like, that green, though, it's just... It's too alarming. It's... it's look at, look at the way you see that with his arm. Like, he's a player that's trying to get... Ooh, what's he gonna do? They call me Mr. Boombastle. What are you up to right now? Reptile Rastafarian. Mm. <laughs> that's such a weird punch. That jump punch. <laughs> <laughs> Orange moon. Has to be. Where is the portal located? In our world? Like, where? See, Katana just talked him to death. That's that's what happened. She talked to him about his plight, and he's like, no! mm. Mm. Oh, and you, you'll all be very happy to know that the reason that the uh, combat is actually going smoother on the emulator now is the USB controller. So, kind of a bitch Works like a slow sweep on Sub-Zero. We all know that too. But yeah. I keep saying that, but yeah. Round two. No. 
Should we cross-reference the amount of blue that Sub-Zero is wearing? Because, like, this is the younger Sub-Zero, but, like, in, in Mortal Kombat 3, his blue is darker. And I want to say that the blue is darker in Mortal Kombat 1. Super light in this version, for whatever reason. I shall fail. Again. Katana, stop talking them all to death. <laughs> right in front. See, like, I killed Sub-Zero. Stepfather. Oh. Dun-dun-dun-dun-dun. Uh, yeah, even Raiden's thing is darker. Oh, she's clawed, dude. She's clawed. I'm waiting to punch him in the dick. That's right. <clears throat> Fan throw. Boom. Uh, trying to get this on me. It's battle. Now, see, he'll do that. He'll do his little hi. <sighs> Defeated by a throw. <clears throat> that seems to be a thing during this massive semi playthrough. I don't even know. like I, I get to Shang Tsung or Kintaro then I'm done. Just wanna showcase the characters fighting all the other characters and then maybe the semi boss. But like I said, without safe states I cannot do it. I am not your champion of Mortal Kombat. Never was. Not at least not Mortal Kombat 2. Like Mortal Kombat 1 It could be done. But have to respect the timing, though, on, on Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat 3. Oh, I'd probably have my ass handed to me. I mean, because they just. This is new mechanics and the whole. New, new, that whole combo system in that one. It's just like. Yep, there's a Deadpool fatality that uh, I always fail to do. Fatality. Yeah. <sighs> It's a nice continue screen. Um, oh, speaking of, when I remember when I asked where is the portal exactly, they kind of, uh, they kind of draw it all out in that wonderful game that I, I never talk about called Shaolin Monks. And I will destroy you, Raiden. I will destroy you in your blue apron and your white pants, or whatever it's called, your little hat, your little dog too. I will. I hate when he does that. Oh, got go. Someone does it. Oh. Mm. Need to rethink my strategy with Raiden. I can't spam him like I could with Melina because one, Katana's freaking thing is a projectile and it's easier to block, and easier to see coming. The best that I can do is the best that you can do. The best that you can do is do a fan lift and then throw the fan. Oh, that's the best that you can do. See? I foreshadowed my own victory. Classic. I'm a genius, I know. Raiden is spam central though. Wait till you guys see the Raiden videos. Like, we'll just be oh, spam central. Just like, cause that's what I'll do. I'll just go. Bah, 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 bah. I need to inform Raiden of something though. I need to inform Raiden. Katana's over ten thousand years old. That's right. That's right. So, fun fact for these videos so thus far, I've been able to do the fatality of the pit and the tomb. Or both. Ah, it's the fucking hat guy. He has a name! What's his name, kitty? Uh, according to my cat, his name's Ugh. Yes, Ugh. Must be cat for Kung Lao. My favorite of the two Shaolin monks. So I don't know if any of my opinions are pretty po polarizing on the uh, Mortal Kombat characters here, but there are some uh, crucial dynamics that I that have been around for a long time that I'm not really a fan of. And then there's some stuff I am a fan of. Round two. My cat's like, shut the fuck up, dude. Let me just claw you. 
You just claw your legs. Look at you, pathetic human playing a video game recording before you have to go to the job you hate. Ah, bummer. It's the good laugh, like in the original timeline too. Oi. Round three. Fight. Who loses a Kung Lao in the original timeline? <laughs> Granted, that Kung Lao was like 10 times cooler than the original. I mean, the original timeline Kung Lao was cool than the whiny, bitchy one. Oh, well, fairness, uh, like the whole. The whole new timeline. Oh, cat. I'm not a fan of. They're all whiny and bitchy. Oh, it is. They're just whiny and bitchy. It's Frasier Season 9 all over again. I still love that season. I fucking love that show. It's my all-time favorite show. Season 9 has it. Season 9 is not as bad as Season 8. Like, Season 8's worse. Like, oh. But there's one or two great episodes. And then, and then, and if Season 8 had never happened, I would not have came in here. They say, oh, they say, what do they say? They say that the reason they did season 11 was just because season 10 was just a huge failure and they were going to pay the fan by doing the 11th season right. It's just a better version of season 10, but if they wanted to do that, they could have just like never had season 8. And it would have been. But I don't want to get into that. That's like, I mean, let's fucking talk about Frasier. How do you bring up Frasier through Total Combat? Like, God, I love these progressions. These fucking things. Oh, the arch. Fuck. Oh, get off now. Ow, oh, that hurt. I'm having problems with my cat. Orange Moon <laughs> must be. It's like my favorite line from this now. And here we are into that magical living force again. Go away, get out of here. Alright. We're going to do this. We're going to do it right this time. We'll respect the timing. Do do. Boom! Kitana wins. Maybe the cool out was a dick. Look at that guy in the bottom, that tree in the left, like, her, her, I'm tree! No. You're not. Ooh, there's Jade. Quick cameo. Fun stuff. You could unlock Jade in 1993, you just had to pay for the fucking, you know, extra cartridge. Oh, no, wait, that was before. That was back when this was just midway, and they were owned by Warner Brothers, huh? Oh my god. Princess Kitana is over 10,000 years old. <laughs> that's just gonna. That's the meme now. This is the meme of the video. Oh dear. Oh dear. This is not even gonna end well. This is not. Oh my. Oh god, not the fearsome balls, not the bowls! Eat my bowls, eat my skulls! Not his flaming skulls, not his sack of skulls! Not those tangy skulls! Uh, a bumblebee wins. Kitana sucks. Hoping against hope, such an endearing human trait I'm touched. Of course, he had a fucking more from that one character that I can't do. Okay, you know what? In all fairness, I like you more than Johnny Cage Jacks. I would probably, probably rather be like you than Johnny Cage. And again, it's like nothing against your character or anything. It's like, I just don't care for your moveset. Like, I don't, put it this way, I don't know how to best utilize you, Jax. I don't. Kalau, I can utilize. Oh, bitch. Dare taunt me with Molina. You know he's gonna fucking kill me too. But, yeah. Bravo, Shang. Same thing I would have done. Spam the roll right into a projectile and never see it coming. God, how could I fall for that? <sighs> oh, 
can't give up. We can't give up. We have to make it to old Kevin Michael Richardson. We have to. Ah, again, spam to freaking spam. Morph to Johnny Cage. Just characters. You're taunting me, see? He knows that those are the characters that I hate. You're just taunting me. How dare you, Shang Tsung? How dare you? God, what the throws? Come on now. What? <laughs> you just wait, Shang Tsung. You, you, you wait till Raiden comes out. I will destroy you with Raiden. You wait till I'm Shang Tsung. And I will spam you with my own dolls. My skulls. Eat my skulls. Lick my skulls. Oh, block. Block and all your stupid ass moves. Oh, right there. That connected beautifully. Oh. Yes. Uh, oh, fucking slide. God. See, I'm so fo- mm. So focused on Shang Tsung. That would make Shang Tsung a really great character. Like, he has three moves, and that's it. He can do fireballs. <laughs>